All right, guys. Today we're gonna be playing Fortnite, but on my phone. Now, if you guys don't know, apparently Fortnite has a different sort of like engine or something, which allows Fortnite to look more realistic on a phone than it would look like on my PlayStation. Which is a little sad because my PlayStation is so much more expensive and my phone ain't nowhere near the amount my PlayStation is. But, yeah, it has better graphics, which is pretty crazy. So, right now, I'm just playing on my uh, controller. I'm using my PlayStation controller to play on my phone. So, I want to show you guys this amazing map i found it's called uh pool rooms ffa and this is a gun game now i'm gonna be playing this game in this video and i'm gonna try to keep it short with the little tour i'm about to show you guys so you guys can experience it yourself now if you guys want if you guys don't really care about how you play the game or where you play the game or what the game is or how it is but you only care about the graphics then if you're like me then uh, I suggest playing on a phone because it is better graphics. Now, the thing I don't like is that it's a small screen. I don't, I'm not a big fan of small screens. But the thing I do like is that the graphics are better. The game runs pretty smooth. You could also connect your controller if you don't feel like you want to play with your uh, hands or like fingers or the phone itself. So it gives you variety as well. Now, if you could just put it on a charging port like I'm doing right now, just play the game like a little TV, it's actually pretty fun. So let's play this game and let me show you a little tour real quick. Now, let me let you guys know that this is a phone, okay? Not a PC, not a PS5, not no nothing like that. This is a phone. And my PlayStation 4 can't even handle this. But yeah, somehow my phone is able to put graphics that look like this. And the lighting looks crazy. I like the lighting in here. Like, look at this spot right here. That looks beautiful. And look at the way my character contracts with the light and stuff. It's amazing. Same thing with this room right here. It's more of a brighter room than a darker room. And it looks pretty good. Then if you go over here... Over here, up here. Oh, shoot, wait. Over here. Yo, look at this. Look at this right here. Oh, shoot, wait. How am I supposed to get in here? Oh, yeah. See this? Look at this. This is pretty cool. So, wow, look at this. Look at the lighting here. Look at look at the shadows and stuff. That's crazy. You can just slide down. Whee! And back down here. This looks so crazy from this angle because like there's so much lighting and stuff. So let's try playing one game. I'm not really too good with games that you can't build in. But I just want to give it a try. And you know, see it. So first of all, let me put the the the. Ooh, I leveled up. I leveled up. Wait, let me see if I can buy the battle pass. I meant um, about to claim the page. Wait, I can't claim the page. Hey, so now we got some new stuff too. That's crazy. That's a triple today. That's crazy. That looks nice. Alright. So it's not too bad. I got some new rewards. I finished leveling up. I'm level 100 now. We all good. So now let's start playing this publicly. Let me just change my settings to just me. Because I don't want to hear no kids and stuff. I think this should be good. But let me just... Put it to nobody real quick. So I try playing a quick little game. And uh, yeah. Let's hope that this game is pretty fun and pretty cool and not too bad. And I'm going to try to keep this video short because my phone is... Woo! It's already through the roof. 
So let's. Sh I mean, my phone isn't through the roof because of the game. My phone is through the roof because of the storage I have contained in here. But yeah, and then only that while I'm charging my phone while playing on it, so it's heating up my phone pretty much. But if you guys charge your phone and have a lot of storage, and like there isn't too much photos and stuff warming up your phone so quickly, this could literally be the best experience for you. Oh shoot, I don't think anybody's gonna join. Oh man. Well, that's sad. That's sad. I really wanted to verse somebody in this game because it would have been so cool. But oh well. I got another game for you guys. It's a pretty cool game and it has to do all with lighting and realisticness. And it's pretty good. Now, I got another game. I gotta show you. It's uh, it's a ep it's made by Epic Games, and it's one of those first like possibility games that they made. One of the first games that they made uh, with the it's called the spaceship or something like that, or the space jump, whatever. And we're gonna try playing that game because I know that uh, that game could be really realistic if you have the right settings or the right graphics with it. So I'm gonna try that. I'm gonna try that. Now this game is all about lighting and realisticness and all that stuff. I haven't actually seen any cave art though, but I think maybe I might have missed it or it's called cave art because the whole cave itself is a piece of art. I don't know, but yeah, so let's wait for this to load. Mm -mm -mm. Let's check the item shop. What the hell? Oh my God, what is, what is this? Mm. Mm. Oh my god, I love the Stormtrooper skins, bro. Like, they look so good. But yeah. Alright, let's do this, people. Let's see how realistic this phone could actually get. Now, I'm surprised that this is all happening in a phone. Not on a PC, not on a PS5, not on an Xbox but on my phone i mean it is running by an xbox i think but it's on my phone like like i could play poppy playtime right now and it won't look half as realistic as this look at that look at that all right so we start off here let's go explore this cave ah i thought it was breakable look at this right here Look at that. The lighting and everything is crazy. Wow. It really gets me thinking what are the possibilities of Creative 2.0 right now. Look at that. Beautiful. Let's go over here. Wow. I love the shadows and the contrast between the lights and the dark parts. And then, not like that, but look over here. Look at the shadows and stuff. Oh, look. I'm not sure if you guys could see. Oh, for a sec, I thought they were my footprints. But nah, there's like footprints in this hand and stuff. I thought they were mine. But nah, bro, look at this. Oh, look, there's a little building over here. What is this about? Look at this little building and how realistic it looks. It's like one of those things where you see it and it's pretty cool. I don't know that glitch. That's a glitch, but look at how beautiful this is, bro. Amazing. Ah, I fell. All right. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. So, that's actually pretty fucking cool. I never... Would have thought when I would ever turn out like that, especially on a phone. On a phone, like that's crazy. So let's see if we can play any other fun games. Hmm. Oh yeah, I gotta do this one. The space inside. Oh shoot, that's copyright. That's copyright. Oh my god. Uh, I need to work on that. Anyway, but yeah. So basically, we're gonna check this map and then we're gonna end the video because again, I can't make the video too long. But overall, these maps are so cool, and exploring them is just amazing. And the fact that it's on my phone 
like oh my gosh and the thing is that most people have phones so playing fortnite and just buying like a playstation controller there you go there you go that's all you need you don't need nothing else i mean you could play genshin and other games like that as well that have also these amazing graphics so it's not only fortnite there's other games as well that you could play on an xbox or microsoft like minecraft and stuff like that um but i think minecraft costs money so yeah look at this cutscene right here that looks insane all right look at the little dim light in the room all right all right what is this a key Oh my gosh. Do you guys see the way that opened up? And look at my shadow and the lights and stuff. That is crazy. Oh shit, the lights turned off. Okay. And then we got like even a first person mode. Now you might have already seen this on other YouTube channels. But the thing that's crazy for me is that this is happening all on a phone. Can you guys believe that? Okay, it's got this gun right here. All right, now we gotta break this. Perfect. Look at the little shards of glass there. Wow. That looks amazing. That looks great. And a, the secret shelf thing is pretty cool. I never would've thought that anybody had the idea. Now look at that. Is that is that a switch? Is that a switch? Ah! All right. Whoa, bro! Look at this. Wow. Oh, look, a little switch right here. Nah, bro, what? This is Fortnite? That's crazy. And the fact that I'm experiencing this, too, like, oh, my gosh. Bro. Bro. No way. All right, let's try completing this game real quick. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I like this. I really do like this. It's amazing how I'm doing this on a, like, literal phone. A phone. That's what's making me crazy. Because, like, I thought I needed to buy a PC or something super expensive to get these kind of graphics. And I'm playing on it on a phone. Like, that's crazy. Now we open the last leverage and let's see how this works. All right, let's go. Look at that. Doesn't that just look crazy? And then the way it darkens in the room as we're in this place, this alleyway that is in the middle this is a prop alleyway. This isn't even a real alleyway. Unlock. Now we unlock the door. I love the green light shining on my guy. Like, that's crazy. I like how the light is reacting to the player. Like, you see this? Look at my shadow here. And the shininess and stuff. It kind of reminds me of Star Wars. Now here. We got this. Look, yo, what? Oh my gosh. Wait, did it close? No. Mm, I'm driving on this pod, I see. Taking me up to these stairs. No, I can't believe that. 
and click. All right, no, nah, bro, that is crazy. Can you guys just take a second to admire how realistic this game is? Like Jesus, Fortnite really is like the future of games. Like everything they're doing is so good. Oh my gosh. Here we go. Let's see. And there we go. I think that's the end, right? Alright, so let me end the video here because I don't want the video to be too long. So thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. This was a crazy experience for me because I never expected to be playing on a phone that has better graphics than my own PlayStation 4, which is crazy. And not only that, make sure to like, subscribe, and if you want to see more videos like this, I'll be posting a part two of me exploring uh, more like spots that are realistic and reviewing them with you guys and letting you guys know about this. If this has inspired you guys to download it, I would suggest downloading it. It is not too bad and it is pretty fun. Also, I suggest playing with a, a controller if you're like a controller player because it is so much more comfortable playing with a controller. If you guys don't know how to do that, I might make a review or you can just search up how to connect your controller to your phone so yeah guys thank you so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one bye